Wow, all of this box save now. Hey everyone, welcome back to Munyal Media. So in today's video, I'm going to take you on another Konakri tour. Make sure to check out our previous Konakri tour on this channel if you haven't already. And so today's tour is going to be shorter than the last one, but it's going to be just as exciting. Here we go. So here we are at the Konakri port. Uh, Guinea is the world's top exporter of bauxite and it holds the world's largest bauxite reserve. The country also produces and exports gold, iron, cashew nuts, peanuts, and other products. So it's very interesting. So you can see the size of the port. You can see uh, the extent of the activity um, and just, you know, the volume of some of the products that are being prepared for export. What do you guys think? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Here we are back on the university campus. This is Université Gamal Abdul Nasser or du Conakry. This is the main university. Remember in our last video, I gave you a nice campus tour. You see how lovely the campus is, how green it is. And so this is another view. I didn't capture, um, you know, these views uh, in my previous vlog. Did you see this uh, balcony right here? I really like that. What do you guys think? Okay, so yeah, enjoy the little tour. I'll be with you in a minute. Mowre ma o wakilo se la pula la Porco un coyo imbo da roa ba tu baba De boko yo dofto muño ta o lo fa be la Su kambe ben kafe un dare con mi gane wali de la Si ke u wan di dolwa de je ke lo e nan the classes whenever they want. <laughs> They're so cute. Okay. Behind the uh, Grand Mosque, which is called Faisal, uh, Faisal Grand Mosque, there is a garden and there is a mausoleum within that garden. Some of our historical figures, like our heroes, they are buried in that mausoleum. Al-Fayaya, Jallo, you just saw Mbalia, Kamara. So these were um, our revolutionaries, like our anti-colonial leaders. You know, you got to read the story about Al-Fayaya, Jallo. He put up a fierce resistance to the French. He died in 1911, 1912. Check Wikipedia to verify the dates. 
So, you know, after the Berlin Conference, 1884-1885, um, when Europeans wanted to conquer and colonize Africa, so they kind of rampaged all across the continent. And of course, there was fierce resistance, whether in Guinea or Sudan or Ethiopia. You know, think of 1896, Battle of Adwa. And in the same 1896, when Ethiopia was having the Battle of Adwa, Guinea was having this resistance by Alpha Yaya Jallo. And you'll see in 1896, 1897, he signed a document, you know, effectively like tricking the French. You can read about the history more. It's quite fascinating. Anyways, in the end, you know, Guinea was conquered by the French. And independence was regained by Sekou Touré in 1958. And Guinea went for a complete and a total independence, unlike some other African countries in the region, like, say, um, Senegal, uh, Niger, and so forth. That's why the CEFA, that's why those countries still use the CEFA, you know, which is very much linked to France. You guys can do your research there it's like a kind of economic slavery basically um, so guinea never had that <laughs> ونعوذ بعظمتك اللهم أن نغتال من تحتنا اللهم إنا نسألك الخير كله عاجله وآجله ما علمنا منه وما لم نعلم ونعوذ بك من الشر كله عاجله وآجله ما علمنا منه وما لم نعلم اللهم إنا نسألك من الخير ما سألك منه نبيك وحبيبك محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم ونعوذ بك من الشر كله ما استعاذك منه نبيك وحبيبك محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم اللهم إنا نسألك الجنة وما قرب إليها من قول وعمل ونعوذ بك من النار وما قرب إليها من قول وعمل اللهم آت نفوسنا تقواها وزكها أنت خير من زكاها أنت وليها ومولاها اللهم إنا نسألك حبك وحب من يحبك والعمل الذي يبلغنا حبك اللهم اجعل حبك أحب إلينا من أنفسنا وأهلنا ومن الماء البارد اللهم لك أسلمنا وبك آمنا وعليك توكلنا وإليك أنبنا وبك خاصمنا وإليك حاكمنا فاغفر لنا ما قدمنا وما أخرنا وما أسررنا وما أعلنا وما أنت أعلم به منا أنت المقدم وأنت المؤخر لا إله إلا أنت ولا حول ولا قوة إلا بالله اللهم بعلمك الغيب وقدرتك على الخلق أحينا ما علمت الحياة خيرا لنا وتوفنا إذا كانت الوفاة خيرا لنا اللهم إنا نسألك خشيتك في الغيب والشهادة ونسألك كلمة الحق في الغضب